All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to start the videos for section 5.2. The first question is to write the symbol for Euler's number. And as we discussed in class, Euler's number, the symbol is written as an E. I guess if uh, I named a, you know, a number after myself, I would start it with my last name too, so I don't blame him. Okay, next set. Locate Euler's number on your graphing calculator and approximate it to the nearest thousand. So let's take out our graphing calculator. Now remember, we're looking for Euler's number. And if you look directly above the division key, you see E. So to get there, we hit second function, division. That pulls E up. Oh, I didn't really mean to be in the graphing mode, so let's get out of that. Let's do quit and go home. There we go. Let's start over again. If I just want to find E on my calculator, I'm not graphing anything right now. I'm going to hit second function, the division key, and Euler's number appears on my calculator. If I hit the enter button, it will actually show me the approximation to Euler's number. So, to answer this question, located on the graphing calculator, Euler's number is above the division key, and to the nearest thousandth, E is approximately, because it's not exact, but it's approximately 2.718 to the nearest thousandth. Okay, E is Euler's number. It's approximately 2.718. We find it above the division key on the graphing calculator. And now the next thing they want us to do is to use Euler's function on the graphing calculator. And they want us to approximate E raised to the 3 point... Okay, so in other words, they want us to evaluate E to the 3.7299 power. They want us to give the answer to the nearest thousandth. Well... Euler's function is the function that takes Euler's number and raises it to a power. And if you look above the natural log key, you see e to the x. Okay, And that e to the x is called, it's actually Euler's number, but turned into a function. It's an exponential function. So to get to, to, get to Euler's function, we hit second function ln. And notice on the graphing calculator that has brought up e caret, and it's raising it to a power. That's what the caret means, okay? And the power we were asked to put in was 3.7299. 3 point seven two nine nine. And I like to close parens, and I'm going to hit enter. And to the nearest thousandth, my answer would be 41.67. And that 4 that you see is going to round up to a 5 because of the 9 that comes after it. So, Euler's number raised to the point 37299 power is approximately equal to 41.675. And we did that using Euler's function on the calculator. We could have also gone to Euler's number and typed in our own exponent key. Okay.